Hello friends, for this week I've got a new log for you and that's the CASP 140-40. Um, that's a nice log in green with an interchangeable core and I've got the same in yellow yesterday and this green one just today and I'm showing you the green one because it's a little easier to pick. It has a very um, tight warding I would say and I barely get my pick in you will see in a second I go as most of the time bottom of the keyway I have picked this uh, the primer in the top also it depends sometimes it's easier this way sometimes easier with bottom of the keyway so I'm just feeling for the pins to get a slight false set because I've already seen a video I think it was from SteamC of a slog and there are several spools and also some serrated pins inside you see me hassling with a warding and I will show you a key later and it has some very low pins and I can get barely under these pins. Well, yeah, I got a fault set. <coughs> and I try um, to loosen the tension a little bit to get the pin under, uh, to get the pick under the lower pins to reach other pins in the back which might not be set already I have to pick uh, sometimes a little bit sideways which is not so good for the pick itself but uh, I have no other chance on this lock my pick is a little bit too big for this Oh, here it's open. This uh, was a faster try. I have uh, tried with a green one uh, two times after work. Here's the key. You can see there are three very low pins. And I think um, between the first two, there's pin number two, which is very high and very hard to reach. It is the yellow one. I will pick it later for you. And now I have a little surprise for you, which I will show you in a second. And this week I got a little package from Matt Mabel, and inside was some steel for new picks and this little Abus 6040i30. And here's the key. It has a high pin uh, hiding behind a very low pin in position number three and I will make a quick pick for you. It's actually not that hard to pick this lock. Um, actually just give it a little bit of tension and feel for um, a binding pin. And uh, as you have seen, pin number 3 is very low and you have to move carefully your pick, not to overset this. Yeah, I take a little um, a smaller tension wrench than before, because it's a smaller lock. Here I'm feeling for the pins. Oh, <laughs> this was really a quickie again. A nice little lock. As I said, feel carefully for the pins and if one is really stuck it might be a low one. Move carefully uh, under him and to the front. 
And then it's not that hard to pick it. Mm. Yeah, show you size comparison to the cast. It's really nit a nice little uh, lock. And it's actually a little bit um, smaller than the baby lock. Mm. But there's uh, a lot in common with this. Have a nice evening and thank you for watching.